Well, friends and family, we're gathered here in the sight of God as witnesses to unite Jared Ross Schwartz and Brittany Joe Toll in marriage. God has created and ordained marriage, and we see this in Genesis where God declares, it's not good for man to be alone. I will make a helper suitable for him. Jared, Brittany, as God's children, your marriage is strengthened by your obedience to him and to his word. As you allow God control of your marriage, he will cause your home to be a place where you can find joy, refuge, and strength to face all of life's challenges. My love, Jared, I knew on that day at church when I first laid eyes on you, you were the one for me. The way you held me, smiled at me, looked at me. I've longed for someone to look at me the way you did and do every single day. The love and grace you extend to me and my kids is something I'll never be able to thank you enough for. Brittany Joe, here we are four short months later. Before I met you, I was beginning to believe that I was going to be a single father for many years to come. I was okay with this reality and believed there was a reason and purpose in God's plan. Little did I know then, God was just waiting on me to let go of control. You've given me so much confidence and strength to trust again. God knew what He was doing when He brought you into my life. You make me laugh like no one else can, and you wipe my tears when I feel broken. You pray for me, for us, for our family and friends. You lead in love with intention, and I adore that about you. Morning devotional and coffee dates next to you overlooking the sunrise will forever be my favorite. When we met, I had my reservations and certainly held my hesitations but you consistently showed your true character. Never in my life have I met such a genuine person so full of love and grace. You have loved me so deeply, intentionally, and consistently that I knew God had made you perfectly for me. Here I stand today as your man, declaring I'll always give you my best. No matter what life brings us, I promise to be your steady rock. I promise to daily seek the Lord with you and always place Him before you and you before everyone else. Jared, my lover, best friend, partner in crime. I can't promise you that tomorrow will be perfect or that life will be easy, but I can promise you this. I'll be right by your side through all of it. With seven kids, things can be chaotic and not always easy, but I promise to support this family with you and a household filled with laughter, patience, grace, understanding, and love, and only occasional mental breakdowns. <laughs>
been such a blessing to watch a relationship unfold before my eyes. What I didn't know all those months ago, when Jared and I shared his hopes and dreams, that he would one day marry my best friend. Jared, you found her. Um, it's an honor to stand here in front of you as your uh, best man. Jared emphasized how great you were. You love the Lord and how perfect you were for him. Meeting you and seeing how he loves you and how you love him, all that stuff, I, could, I just wish you the greatest marriage that you could possibly have. While we have covered so many miles in our fast and furious romance, I am thrilled at the life God has planned before us. Today, I get to marry my very best friend, who has shown me only the most amazing grace, unwavering unconditional love, and the selfless heart of God lived out daily. I look forward to waking up next to you, the man of my dreams for eternity. Chocolate clouds, CPAP machine and all. I can't wait to meet you at the end of the aisle, baby. Thank God for you, and I pray that I get to wake up as your husband for tens of thousands of sunrises to come. I love you, baby. Thank you for choosing me as your forever life partner in crime. You light up my world, and I'll never take you for granted. I don't know what I did to deserve you, but I'm so grateful you're mine. Here's to a lifetime of bliss. Forever yours, Brittany. Brittany.